Hi, and welcome back to our channel, All That Fluff and Stuff. So today I am shopping for a Christmas hamper, preferably one that has some little jams in them. So we will be going to two shops, and this is our first stop at Target. They don't look very exciting, and I'm actually after ones that have jam. What's in this one? Nice little box. So some wafer biscuits, nougat bar, 20 bucks. Heaps of chocolates. I don't want any chocolates. I mean, I'd eat them. <laughs> But I don't want any. Oh, remember the stockings, the chocolate stockings? <laughs> Yum. Actually, the shelves are a bit bare in Target. And here we go. Look at that one. That's got the jams in it, the little jams that I was after. Bar. I can buy this brand. And coals. And they're forty dollars. Let's have a closer look. It's in there. See those little jams? I can buy those little jams and coals. And I'm pretty sure I can get Walker's gingerbread and coals. That's not gingerbread, shortbread. 40 bucks. I've always thought that these are overpriced. Oh my goodness, look. Here is my Christmas tree made of sticks <laughs> at Target. How much is that? $95. That doesn't look too bad. $95. Mine's homemade. <laughs> so anyway, Target doesn't seem to have a lot of gift baskets. Christmas hamper gift baskets. They're not the ones that I want. I'd love to get ones with some beautiful little jams in it. And not the jams that I can buy in Coles. So we might go to another shop and see what they have to offer. These ones are 20. Let's have a closer look. Some hazelnut chocolate, some nougat, and nougat, however Dan says it. Oh, this has got English breakfast tea. How much? 20 bucks. Rectangular. Wooden tray. Don't know. Probably not this one. Let's keep having a look around, shall we? So I found this one, it's 50 bucks. Let's have a look what a gift Christmas hamper looks like for 50 bucks. So it's got some milk chocolate chunk, some Ferreros, Belgium Harvest chocolate, some cookies. It's in a nice enough container, but I don't know. 50 bucks. I mean, it does look pretty and all. I'm after a jam one. Oh, there's a gift basket for 70. Rightio, so let's walk into Myra and see what they've got in the way of food hamper packs. Hopefully some good ones with jam. Let's go. Okay, 
so here's some hampers. Really not the ones that I'm after. Cookies. Dressings gives under 80 bucks. Oh, I just know that these are going to be expensive. But can we just take a moment to appreciate just how beautiful this is? Isn't that sweet? The tea set. <laughs> okay, so where are all the teas? Let's go. One thing that really gets to me about Myers is that they advertise that there's 25%, but when I went to the register, it scanned up full price. So always make sure you check. Oh look, we can get our personalised Vegemite. Good old Vegemite, eh? Yum. Packs. Truffle oil, truffle salt. There's some chutneys, some dressings, mustard, some rubs. Here we go, the ultimate barbecue collection. Look at the gorgeous nutcrackers, would you? Aren't they just sweet? Looky here, we found the jams. Here we've got some plum puddings, everyone. So I found my little jams. So this is the one that I'm going with. <laughs> I'm really happy about this. Merry Christmas to me. Woohoo! Yeah, look at all these. I'll have fun all year with these. I feel like there's not a lot of hampers in Myers. As this is the selection that I've found. So not a very big selection. Although I don't mind this one. It comes with its little cookie container. <laughs>
I feel like very pretty <laughs> is the in thing. Because look how gorgeous everything is. Absolutely beautiful. The pretty look, I call this. And I've got a funny feeling. It's this year's fashion. The very pretty range. I mean, look at this. This is very pretty. So obviously, very pretty is in season this year. <laughs> I love it. Okie dokie, so now I'm back home, I'm going to share with you what I purchased. Now I struggled to find a really good Christmas hamper. <laughs> I mean, maybe I was a little bit too late, but I could not find a Christmas hamper that had a variety of some very yummy cookies and a great selections of little gourmet jams. So this is a Christmas present to one of my besties and she loves her teas. So let's have a look what this selection offers. Ooh. Licorice lover tea. Mm. <laughs> Not too sure about that one. Blue magic tea. Mm. So it would be interesting to know exactly how these teas are. There's a good old Aussie one. Too dry, vast, and a whole lot of soul. Australian tea. <laughs> now into my fridge. I've already opened up my little jams. Scottish black currant. Lemon curd. These are really small. I think I think it's 42 grams, so they're very small. But that's okay. 
orange marmalade with ginger. Mm. Strawberry with champagne. Oh gosh, yum. <laughs> Raspberry and red currant. Mmm. Celebration marmalade with champagne. Is this the one with champagne? Yep. So two with champagne and orange marmalade, fine cut. Ooh, that sounds very delicious. So they're the little jams that I purchased for myself. Cannot wait. Seven of them. Cannot wait to give them a little try. I think the idea with these little jams is, is to taste them and see which one you like the best. Because I'm pretty sure I did see jams that were much, much bigger. So as you could see, there wasn't a big variety of those Christmas hampers left. Maybe I left it a little bit too late, but I'll tell you what, once Christmas is over, I'll be hitting Target and Myers to see what hampers are left and usually we can get them on a discounted price so i will be doing that anyway i want to take this opportunity to wish everyone a very merry christmas take care stay safe and see you next time